Good morning. It's Epiphany Thursday, January 6, 2022. I'm Russell, and this is Rocky Road Devotions, a few minutes of help for your journey today. Our devotion today is entitled Epiphany, and our scripture is Isaiah chapter 60. Arise, Jerusalem, let your light shine for all to see, for the glory of the Lord rises to shine on you. Darkness as black as night covers all the nations of the earth, but the glory of the Lord rises and appears over you. My mother never talked about her twin sisters. They died in the cradle during the influenza pandemic of 1918, around the time Mom was born. As today, that was a dark time in this world's history. Approximately 500 million people were infected, and one in ten died from its onslaught, taking about 1% of the world's population. If there's anything we can count upon in dark times, it's how brightly the light shines through the backdrop of night, a perfect frame for the coming light. And that describes Epiphany well. The coming of our Lord to a murky world had nothing to do with a biological darkness, but rather a spiritual darkness that enveloped 100% of the population. The prophets preached that, as well as the New Testament apostles, that there are no exceptions. Sin is a human virus, and we are all infected. And then the light dawned. It was the appearance of light in great darkness. Just as the greatest dark must give way to the smallest light, so the ravenous bitterness of total darkness must vanish in the presence of perfect light. And that was who was laid in the manger cradle, the bright and morning star, the one who would declare to the entire world, I am the light of the world. If you follow me, you won't have to walk in darkness, because you will have the light that leads to life. For you today... Scripture and history both affirm that Jesus was and is the light of the world. The question for all of us is, is he the light that's come into your world? You chew on that as you hit the rocky road. Have a blessed day.